morning everybody uh, today is Tuesday the 26th of February and uh, we're actually in Warren Michigan right now the temperature is really not that bad I think it's like 40 degrees this morning was definitely much worse it was pretty chilly essentially long story short I uh, emptied out here just not too long ago and I'm supposed to be going to Lima Ohio in uh, Lima, Ohio is only like 160 miles away. Before I got going, I just kind of went and checked the road situation and looks like there was an accident uh, on the way, which is making me slower by two hours. And I only have 160 miles to go, so I figured I'd just wait a little bit more for that to clear out. I do have a GPS, uh, truck GPS and my iPad GPS. But one thing I, I, I really hate about it is, uh, what's it called, how my app won't connect every time to my, uh, to my truck GPS to give me uh, directions and take traffic in consideration. But yeah, going to Lima, Ohio, I'll try to just kind of like try to avoid the accident spot, but it should be clear by now. Had some good breakfast just now. Cooked up the usual egg, sausage, bread. Uh, having this fair life milk, really good stuff. I'm sounding more like an advertising person more and more with each video, but yeah, I like this stuff. Uh, fair life milk. Have a banana, some some mandarins, and then we'll get going. Uh, our delivery is not till tonight until uh, like midnight. So we definitely have a lot of time. Uh, I did not get my Planet Fitness membership, but there's a Planet Fitness like five miles from where I'm going. So for instance, right now it's noon. I could be there if I left right now, I could be there by three, four o'clock. I still have like eight hours to kill. So I could easily go work out, but I just didn't bring my workout stuff or anything, or do I have a membership? So I think this weekend when I go home, I'm gonna go Planet Fitness get a membership. And then once I'm on the road, you know, I'll be able to go. Plus tonight, like after I empty out, I could easily go work out uh, and, and shower and so on. But we'll see about that. I might, when I go down there, I'll see what stores are near. I might go to uh, a couple stores. I don't know if you guys are familiar, but I do try to like flip things here and there. I'll go to like Ross, Marshalls, just buy random stuff and... Uh, what they call it is retail arbitrage. I don't sell it on Amazon, I sell it on eBay. It's a little hard when I'm on the road, I can't ship it, but I still try to do it. Yeah, but enough blabbering, talking. We're gonna get going here shortly. Uh, and uh, I'll just slap the camera on my head and give you guys some point of views that you've been asking for. Uh, you'll basically be seeing what I'm seeing. So yeah, thanks for watching and catch you guys later down the road. <clears throat> All right, everyone, it's time to get going. Got to crack my neck. All right, great trip done. Reaper is good. Time to get going, and we do have two GPSs, and you can see they're sending us the opposite ways because I do not believe that the truck GPS, even though I managed to connect it to my iPad. I don't think it's following the fact that there's a closure on I-75 as the Google Maps is telling me. So I think uh, I'm gonna tell me alternate route. Uh, I think uh, as my instinct is telling me, I should follow my. Google Maps. Well, now it's rerouting me the same route, it looks like. My neck keeps hurting, I don't know why. So I have to keep, like, doing this. For some reason, this one's not allowing me to make a left up there, but 
we'll give it a shot. There's no no truck signs, so it should be fine. I've been at this spot maybe like twice before. So and every time I've been here, they had a bunch of road closures and road work and all this stuff. So we'll just go ahead and make a left here. It looks fine. Warren, Michigan. I forgot what the place is called that I went to all the way up in Michigan, but it was way, way up north. Probably like two, three hundred miles north from Detroit. But it was beautiful. The scenery, it's just kind of, uh, it was like almost like in the country, I guess you could say it. There was no traffic, just kind of like those, you know, those uh, routes. And uh, the place I delivered to was a very trucker friendly town. There's a lot of restaurants that were there, had truck parking in the back, which was pretty awesome. Oh yeah, and uh, I'm sure you can see the phone right there. That's my girlfriend on FaceTime. We're on FaceTime like all the time. It feels like she's with me on the road. I think FaceTime is awesome. Just so I'm not like all alone driving. Well, that's mainly because she's working for the company and it's kind of working on her own time. I'm sure that once she gets an actual full-time job, well, I mean actual, I mean like a regular nine to five, that really won't be the case once she's done with the school. But I don't think she'll be able to do the whole 9 to 5 thing. She'll probably come back to the company and have us do that. But we'll see. We'll see. Enough blabbering will get you to just let us see some driving, I guess. Uh, 80,000 pounds gross 
I don't know what exactly number it is. Uh, you think it's like 150,000? I could be wrong. But I know it's definitely more than uh, 80,000 in the state of Michigan. That's why you see those trucks with a bunch of axles. If you've ever been up here. Hello everybody, welcome back. Johnny Be Good here. Just kidding. Haven't uh, mentioned uh, JBG in a while. Uh, for those of you who, who don't know JBG, definitely check him out. I would say he's probably the guy who's single-handedly responsible for my channel getting so big in, in so big. To me, this is large, uh, 3,500 subscribers or whatever the case. Uh, in this short amount of time, I mean, I've I've been posting videos probably since I think my first video was like November 20th. So if you think about it, today is 25th. That's roughly three months, you know. So I've had it for about three months. So it's definitely grown. Uh, I had a few videos that were, you know, big. Uh, my main video that kind of got me out there was the one video where I uh, hit the fender of the truck and John seen that video and he was like oh no man uh, you remind me of myself and he kind of started giving me shout outs and stuff and uh, he kept telling people to follow me and he, he still does it and you know it's just really awesome I mean you know he doesn't have to do it you just do it out of the kindness and someday I'm gonna pass it on uh, to help somebody else grow their channel uh, Again, thank you John uh, If you do follow me and you don't follow him just chances are pretty slight uh, Go to his channel uh, Say you subscribe to him because of me. I think that'd be funny uh, But yeah, that's my two cents with that essentially what's going on is I've been here at this uh, I believe I'm a pilot either pilot or flying J uh, I'm like 10 miles from my delivery my delivery is at midnight and I know just based on experience 9 out of 10 uh, they don't usually start receiving until midnight with these places 
so I didn't really even bother going there because I didn't see parking anywhere so I just stayed here and then I'm gonna drive down there uh, I don't know at like 10 or so maybe 11 and see what's going on if I can wait somewhere in the front but yeah we're here uh, as far as food goes we're good we're cooking we have food I'm probably gonna cook up some dinner here shortly some pasta and probably sausage the usual but uh, yeah, that's kind of the scenario with that. So I can get you guys caught up so you know what's going on. Uh, we'll probably end the day with this because there won't be too much going on. We're just at a truck stop. Uh, if I did have that Planet Fitness membership, there's a Planet Fitness five miles from here. I could have went. I definitely had a lot of time today, but we'll try to get that in starting next week. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna give you guys a follow up and uh, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe if you haven't, like, share, comment, whatever it is that you'd like to do. Give me your feedback. Uh, we'll catch you guys on the next one. See you later.